Hi there, I'm Java Jim with First Line Equipment and welcome back to watching our videos. Today, we're going to go over pressure profile number two, which I am going to show you how to mimic a lever espresso machine. For those who have spoken to me in the past, you know that I'm a true believer in the lever espresso machines, the old school way. And more importantly, I actually like the spring piston lever machines because they're more consistent as the spring is going up. So today we're gonna to show you how to mimic the lever espresso machine, the piston version on the Lili Bianca. Let's get started. So the first thing to remember, warm up the machine for about 45 minutes, a uh, little less in coffee mode only, or just to have the coffee boiler uh, can happen in 20 to 30 minutes. But if you're going with the steam, please let it warm up for 45 minutes. Make sure the portafilter is piping hot, okay? And we're gonna grind some espresso. Okay, and like I done before, I like to overdose. Level it out. Let's get a little more coffee in there. And again, this is basically keeping the volume the same. The tamping, we're gonna go over again. We're gonna keep that kind of the same. And basically, the only thing we'll have to change, let's get some uh, hot water in this little glass here, preheat that. Okay, take the tamp, index finger, and thumb. Make sure the tamp is even. A little polish. And if you look in there, there's a little line going around that's pretty equidistant with the level of the coffee. Wipe the rim, let's lock it into place. Now this machine has a five second pre-infusion and then it has a three second soak, which basically is to bring down the lever against the spring piston takes anywhere about five to seven seconds for the espresso to drip from the portafilter. And it typically, if you hold it, that can be considered the soak. And then we basically start up with a high ramp pressure when the spring is at the very low end, the lever on the spring, and as it goes up, the pressure decreases. So now we're gonna get started here. And we're gonna be in the full open on the paddle for the full soak. And we got the drip and we're gonna start bringing it down, down, down. We're at 10, nine, eight, six, five, four. And we're gonna get to about two and 27 second shot. Now, compared to the first video I made, I think this uh, espresso is actually uh, a little darker in terms of crema, and we have some nice layering effect right there. So that's uh, one way to mimic the lever espresso machine on the Bianca, and this is actually one of my favorite methods for extracting the espresso. Let's give this uh, espresso a good taste here. It's actually very, very good. If you watched our video uh, on the pressure profiling flow control, uh, the first one that we made had a little bit of a nutty almond flavor. We're ch we haven't even changed the grind setting. We haven't changed the espresso blend here. And here I'm getting some deep chocolate overtones in the espresso. And this is really why the lever is my favorite because that's what I could achieve in the cup to drink a nice straight espresso not necessarily over bitter, but just very smooth with deep uh, chocolate overtones. And that's why I really like the Lili Bianca uh, because basically you can change the espresso, the flavor profile by changing the paddle, somewhat changing the grind, but mostly the paddle and the flow control with the needle valve. And this is what is so exciting about this machine. One machine that I've really gone gaga over uh, compared to other machines in the past because there is nothing like this, nothing. So we hope you enjoyed this video. There's more to come. We're gonna go over some more pressure profiles uh, that you can watch in the future. 
uh, subscribe to us to the side over here. Give us a thumbs up below. And also, if you have any comments, please ask them below. I'd be delighted to answer them for you or have my staff answer them for you. And just have a wonderful espresso day. Remember, coffee first, everything else second. Have a great day.